show the tube what we have here are my legs and this is the controller which we're going to move anyway we have this beautiful pioneer controller which is fucked up don't drink and play music anyway this one is better but we'll clean this one as well and this is the dog she's always somewhere around so uh, let's disassemble it and uh, yeah let's try to fix this thing so uh, yeah <laughs> So yeah, there is a, let me show you a bit. So yeah, the, even this thing, th this part is sticky. Let me see. Yeah, this one is the one that's fucked up. So cleaning this thing will actually be an adventure. I'll probably have to, uh, well, remove everything, I guess. But before I start, a beer the cause and solution to all our problems so uh i guess we'll have to uh, disassemble everything because every single part in here is sticky this thing this thing this thing but it works yeah for how long fun times we'll start What was the drink? Gemisht. <laughs> <laughs> so explain what is this is. Gemisht is basically coke and wine, right? No. No, neo gemisht, what do you think? Neo gemisht, what do you call it? Bambus. This is not gemisht, this is bambus. Because gemisht is wine with water and it's not sticky. And this thing is sticky as hell. So, uh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. By the way, this is horrific. This assembly of this thing. There are so many uh, flat cables that you need to disassemble. But bear in mind that uh, you cannot go wrong because all of them are of different size. So basically, you cannot fail for you know inserting them when you assemble it uh, again. There are, there are actually shitload of screws. So first of all, there are four in here, uh, one in here, one in here, and one in here. This one is silver, and all of the others are black. So I'm guessing it's yeah. I'm guessing that there is there might be a reason for it. So far, they are all of the, of the same size, and there are one. But there are two silver in here, and one black in here as well, and one black in here. So. Again, all are of the same size, so that's promising. Silver ones are a bit longer, so uh, yeah. Okay, so the next thing I will be unscrewing is uh, these screws, because I believe this entire motherboard then will uh, slide out. And again, uh, the screws are of the same size, so even these screws are the same as this ones. so that's kind of awesome. By the way, he went to the kitchen to curse. <laughs> okay. So two screws in here, silver ones. This, this one is silver and this one is black. And again, uh, four screws that were removed. Four, four screws that were removed you know, from this plate, so four screws, silver ones, black ones, silver and silver, so longer ones, and the black one. Okay. So basically this left side has all of the silver ones, so yeah. Let's remove those, and I do actually need to get the uh, magnets. 
but I'm kind of too lazy for that, so uh, yeah. Okay, I somehow managed to remove all of this except the ground, which I will be screwing in just to see whether I can remove all of this. So, uh, so uh, this connector also needs to be removed, which is, I guess, some kind of audio one. It does look like that, and again, some bombus wine and coke. And the sad part is that he actually wasn't the one that spilled the booze, but some drunk idiot. So, after removing this motherboard, one and two, and basically that is it. Now, I do need to uh, unscrew the jog part, because that is the only part I'm interested in. So. Uh, Let me place this thing somewhere and I can tell you right now that there is a shitload of uh, well everything. So uh, yeah, so let's start with this thing. So uh, one screw, two, basically two screws and I believe I'll have to remove the small ones as well. And uh, this bottom part I think that I do not need to actually remove anything from that. Maybe. There are two screws in here, so you know what, uh, first of all, I'm going to try with these two screws because there is an arrow in here, so this could be the thing that's actually holding the entire jog, so I might not need to uh, remove anything else, so we'll see. This thing would be so awesome if only these two hold the jogs, you know. Ah, oh, bloody hell. I'll actually have to remove this thing and this thing as well, because there are tons of screws. So let me give you a better angle, but uh, yeah, shape load of screws. So uh, yeah, this thing will be interesting to put back together. So I've removed uh, the uh, keycaps, so from here and from here, and I don't need to remove this part. And it's actually unusually hard. Which kind of sucks. So basically, uh, you need you need to apply just a bit of force. I use this thing, but uh, uh, you can damage this part if you do not know how to. Well, you should probably use something that's more well, plasticky, I would say. But yeah. So uh, yeah, let's unscrew everything. I would say fuck. Okay. <laughs> Motherfucker. Okay. In theory, I should probably just leave this thing up. Uh, over. Bloody hell. I know it. There is always a hidden screw. So basically you need to remove all of the screws and there are arrows which you need to go by, so yeah. But this thing has been removed, you can actually clean this thing. Yeah, so I'll need to remove uh, these upper ones as well, so yeah. Kinda sucks noodles to be honest. And the good thing is that all of the screws are of the same size. The silver runs are a bit longer, but that's actually it. So, uh, yeah, let's remove this thing. And this thing, and... Uh, yeah. And this part as well, and I think that... Of course, there is a ton more of screws, because why not? Okay, maybe I can just remove this thing. So there are one, two, three, four, five, six. I believe only six screws that hold the jog, but we'll see. Okay. Yeah, it seems so. I think I can actually lift this thing up, which is kind of nice, yes. To uh, remove this, all you need to do is put this thing. 
Uh, and you can actually... This is, <laughs> and this is the display! <laughs> and the jog and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna remove all of those wheels, clean them in alcohol because they are sticky. And even these ones are sticky, seriously. And uh, when we clean that, this thing will be functional as it was. I hope so. Anyway, no. I've used isopropyl alcohol to clean this thing. Now, let me show you. Uh, there are traces of actually paint being removed and uh, so you should probably not use alcohol. I mean, it's not the end of the world, but it kind of gives you the idea about the quality of the paint job of this controller. So, I would say that it's probably something that it's not going to last that much. Yeah, I would recommend you actually cleaning this thing with the uh, liquid you use for cleaning dishes. We'll do that. Shampoo. Yeah. <laughs> And I will actually remove all of these and uh, all of these. So, uh, yeah, I think that you can actually remove them just by pulling them. And yeah, I'm right. So, I guess that's quite easy. They thought about something, you know. And basically, uh, removing this thing is uh, quite simple. You just uh, pull it out. Yeah. There you have it. And uh, I will be removing these ones as well. Again, I believe it's, yeah, it's that simple. But they're, I believe, uh, different? Or are they? No, they're actually, they're the same, the top and the bottom ones. So you can just stockpile them, I guess, and clean them. So this is the idea. I'm using an old toothbrush to remove all the sweet stuff. So basically, coke is not good for anything. So there you have it. This is the uh, last part cleaned. Now I'll be rinsing it and drying it and putting everything back together. So yeah. And uh, let's start putting these things back, you know. Again, it is quite simple. You just... You just press them inside and uh, yeah, that's it. So yeah, we're ready to put the uh, top part back on. Meanwhile... Oh, awesome. So, let's put this thing back on. And already, as you can see, this is the way it's supposed to be. Uh, so, as you can see, there is a, this piece of plastic in here and there is a one that only has one. So, this one is a single piece of plastic and the other ones are double. So, you should... Uh, you see, even this one has a groove which only has one. So. You need to place this thing exactly where it's supposed to be and this is it and now you can actually just click and uh, there you have it this is uh, that's my face yeah but now butter smooth and now I have to put everything back together <laughs> fun part so let's put this thing back together in theory Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Um, So, uh, let's see whether this thing goes through here. Mm -hmm. okay. yep. However, oops. mistakes were made. <laughs> okay, this thing. And these two actually need to be removed and go through here yeah through the plastic what can you do okay so the ribbon back in and I actually have this which I believe There is a screw in here. Fucking useless. Okay. One goes in here as well. Yeah, the noise you hear, that's the dog, so yeah. One in here. And that's more or less it. Mm -hmm. And let's put this thing back in okay so let's put this thing and uh, this thing and let's screw in some screws you know fun times um, okay um, yes so you know what first of all I believe that it four screws in here and I will be screwing them just so that I have uh, because I have limited amount of black screws and first of all those I know that I know where they uh, where they are so, okay in here okay Okay, and now this. So I do remember that we have all of the silver ones in here. So uh, yeah, uh, yeah. So uh, there are four uh, black ones in here, two gold ones in here, which are for this plastic which are for this metal, so uh, yeah. And you know what, just let me show you, let me zoom in a bit. See, this one is actually, it's still uh, under the influence. And this one in here, and you can see the, this connector even has uh, some, uh, some coke so yeah I will be cleaning this thing with the toothbrush and just a teeny bit of alcohol so that it evaporates and I will be actually uh, putting this cable uh, in the last but as you can see it's already dried up so yeah so let's connect this one and this one and you know what, even this one has a bit of uh, a bit of goo. 
not cool, I would say. Not cool at all. And he actually did tell me, oh, oh, by the way, this thing goes underneath, but again, you cannot miss because one has four pins and the other one has three. And uh, even you can see here, this one has four and this one has three. It has, it is, uh, it is printed on, so quite, quite idiot proof, I would say. Okay. Now, if you do not connect everything, even this one has a bit of a goop. You should probably. So yeah, he did tell me. You did tell me that you were not playing, so you actually borrowed, well, in theory borrowed, the uh, controller. But model of the days, never allow anybody to mess with your equipment, right? I'm guessing. Right, uh, okay. Uh, and even in here, some goo. Damn it. So yeah, but will this thing turn on? That is the big question. Okay, and this thing. Clean. There are so many ribbon cables, it's actually astonishing. So yeah, uh, that's almost put back together, you know. Keyword almost, you know. Okay, so uh, any wires loose? No, no, no. And uh, yeah. So let's screw in this thing. So one black. Basically, when it goes to plastic, it's white, and when it goes to metal, it's black. So. So that's the uh, well, the logic. There is actually one more screw that goes in here, which I forgot to screw in. And one screw that goes in here. And one screw that goes in here, which is also black. One screw that goes in here. Which is also black, and one screw in here, <laughs> and now we have to, yeah, so one screw in here as well. So let's see, perfect. But just to be safe, I'll screw in maybe four screws. So yeah, let's uh, let's put everything back together and see whether it works or not. Okay. Okay, power cord. So far so good. Pioneer DJ. So, uh, just a quick test, we already did test it, but I do not want to get my, uh, well, copyright strike because whatever, but yeah, it is working. Now, A. But, so yeah, uh, this was not an easy repair. Uh, having said that, uh, what I meant was, uh, there are so many screws and, uh, well, yeah, until the next time. If you like this video, please click thumbs up. If you did not, well, you know what to do. And, yeah, cheers. Bye-bye.